some things like uh, I had a stopwatch. So uh, the stopwatch, if the stopwatch counts 2.30 minutes, okay. So we will be giving you the warning, okay. For 30 seconds, in that you can give your conclusion. Very pleasant morning to respected HM ma'am, worthy teachers and all my students. Today I am wish student of class 12 be standing in front of you all on the behalf of Blue House. And I am going to speak against the topic, can humans save nature by using technology or destroy it? Technology is opposition to nature. It is produced at the expenses of nature because it, it, it destroys ecological habitats. Sathar Gupta and I am going to present a debate on that topic, can technology save nature or destroy it? and I am going to favor the topic. I admit that in the last two centuries, technology has caused a lot of harm to nature. But if we use technology with respect to nature, we can save the environment. Renewable energy is the type of energy that does not cause damage to the environment. Think for a time, there has been a lot of carbon dioxide in the air and you have that the government had gave you a chance to make a thing which can absorb carbon dioxide without technology. So how can you make this? Uh, as I said, like, there are both sides, like good and bad. But uh, technology is also having bad side because uh, by producing new technologies, uh, like scientists, all the people who are pr producing that use the uh, pr resources of the uh, country or our uh, art which may be sometimes wasteful because uh, by producing uh, there are a lot of pollution. My name is Suyas. I am from class 11 B. In today's debate, I am going to speak against technology and will tell you some negative points about it. So, as you all know, there are so many factories and industries which release harmful gases and produce so pollute the air. And the workers throw the wastage into the rivers which is not friendly with the ecosystem and the vehicles also release noise pollution, air pollution which has a bad impact on the environment and the farmers use chemicals, fertilizers and pesticides to grow more crops. Okay, the time starts now. Good morning to all respected directors, principal man, for the teachers and all my dear schoolmates today. This is Margaret from class 12, 11B from your house. Today I am speaking in the flavor of can technology save the environment. Yes, definitely technology can save the environment. As we all know, our scientists are working very hard at improving their technology to save the environment because environment is very essential for our life. We have some clever minds which are researching on that. And as we can see, many people use electric vehicles and petrol, petrol and diesel are so expensive and they are also polluting our environment. With the hyper technology, we can now use electric vehicles which help our environment to save, which, which decrease the pollution in our environment. If there is no pollution in the environment, we can survive more in our life expectancy. And similarly, carbon computing, electric vehicles, and uh, carbon absorbing buildings, air power electricity are all the those things that we can get from technology and which help our environment to save. And that's, that's a main point that technology is very essential today. Because we all need we all need a simple life, but we can get a simple life through the technology. So technology is very essential for our environment. Thank you. So my question is, as you all know, the scientists are trying their hard for the sustainable development. So the environment can be saved and technology uh, the causes we are having with technology can be minimized. Right? But no, my question is that that the other things which our scientists have in, uh, in, invented they are very expensive. So the normal people, even the average people is not able to uh, buy it for them. So it's uh, the, all the technology now is doing for the uh, safe to environment. It's not even you are seeing in actual life because it is expensive. And average people have many necessity and many other things in which he or she has to spend their money. So they are in favor. Okay, so as we have all seen that this is our modern time. So here all needs technology to work. For example, if a farmer needs to know that how 
how to soon see according to season. So he is having a part of technology for that he can search on that and find how to sew. And uh, technology is also very useful. And technology is also very useful when you have something from the nature, a precious thing, but you don't know how to utilize it or a thing which can utilize. So it has no use. So technology comes here in use. Technology helps us to use and to utilize the thing we get. In the recent time, China has got a business from the moon. It, its name is Chen Sidewalk. It containing an element known as helium 3. Energy as solar panel, wind, water turbines, and 